If I told you everything in life was predetermined, what would be your thoughts on life? Well, if everything is predetermined, I don't really have to think for myself because, you know, everything would just be dull already. Like, yeah. So, in terms of hard determinism, do you believe everything can be pre can be predetermined? Why or why not? I think things like can't be predetermined because you know people are responsible for their own actions like like say say if some like some like like man in the past or something that like, could some happen and like they go and do something to like hurt someone else it's not it's not really because of what happened in the past is what it's like it's their own action like they do it on, on their own like no one tells them to do it so yeah hard determinists believe that free will is just an illusion do you agree with this? Why or why not? I don't think free will is an illusion because you know it, nothing's planned for you. Like you can do whatever you, you you can do whatever you feel like. Like you don't have to like do what's planned for you or anything like that. Like yeah. oh, now, let's say you're a twenty-year-old man, right? Mm -hmm. And your personality is based on the way you were raised, things you've seen and experiences you've been through. Do you think that would predetermine your personality? I think it would because, you know, like you already experienced like some things and like your personality is going to be based off what you saw and what happened during your life and everything. So I think your personality is predetermined already. So if a person's personality is predetermined for them based on the way they're raised, and experiences can they be held responsible for things for the way they think or act or feel about certain things not really because like the person I, like the way they act is like like it's already predetermined for them so like you can't really be held responsible for any for anything that they do because you know like that's the way they are that's the way they're brought up as so are you saying Hitler can't be held responsible for the Holocaust? No, no, he's he's held responsible for that. Cause you know, that he did that on his own free will. Like he wanted to take over a lot of people. But it was because of his personality. Not really. See, cause you know, I don't know what happened to him. The mom like make like, him kill a lot of people. Like, like it wasn't because of his personality. Just. If I told you everything in life was predetermined, what would be your thoughts on life? Life would be sad if everything is predetermined. Because I don't believe everything is predetermined. If you have choices in life, for example, what if I wanted to be like a president? And I was told because it was predetermined for me I cannot be the president, that I should be like the mailman. That wouldn't be fair. Because I have choices to go to school, I have a brain, I have a mind of my own, and I want to think, and I could work towards my goal. So I would dis disagree that life is predetermined for me. Hard determinists believe that everything is predetermined because of its past, and that is what causes the present. Do you believe with this idea? Why or why not? I, dis I disagree. Because past, what happened in your past, you could leave the past behind you and report to the future. You can learn from things that happened to the past, whether it be good or bad. If something bad had happened, you could turn it around to make something good of yourself. You could use it to strengthen you, to do things differently. You could learn life lessons from your past, not to bring it to the future and do things differently. So I disagree. Let's say a person's personality is made of the way they are raised, things they've experienced, and things they've seen. Would you agree that a person's personality can be predetermined because of their past? No. Why? Because you can, you have, you can change the past if you change um, the way things are. For example, if you come from a poor family, a poor home, doesn't mean that you'll stay in the poor. You can make ch uh, life changes like you can go to school. You can do the best of what you're good at. You could change that. For example, if you live in the um, 
what they call the ghetto, or where they were coming into your living, that can, that doesn't determine the kind of person you're going to be in life, or anything that can stop you from grow and reach your goal in life. You can move on, move out, do things differently, and be the best of what you can be and be yourself. That doesn't determine that you're going to sit in the slum or stay there for the rest of your life and be a nobody. You can get out, get going, take control, take charge of your life, and, and move up into society and be the best person in this life. If I told you everything in life is pre was predetermined, what would be your thoughts on life? Why? Because in a way, if, uh, in a way, if everything was predetermined, then like you know, everybody would have their own little psychic vision of how their life would end. So what would be the point of living life if you know what's going to happen to you? Particularly, if everyone has their own little psychic vision of how their life is going to end, what's the point of living life? Because life is supposed to be about being adventurous, being spontaneous doing this, going new ways, going further in life. So if, I re if so life was really predetermined, would you really want to leave your house? Yes. Do you think a person's past can determine their future? No. Why? Because as your previous question about everything being predetermined, you know you can change your future, because you can make your future the way you want it to be. But so that's you're... only if something in the past changes. Not necessarily. Have you ever seen the movie The Butterfly Effect? It was a gay movie. But didn't the past change, the future change? So if I kill the butterfly, something happens in China, what the hell? Yes. Oh shit, you're so great and awesome. Do you know for a fact that when you think about what you're really doing, and then you're gonna end up thinking about, okay, I should be doing something good for my life, because then you're gonna be like, okay, I should be doing this for my mother. I should be. I don't know, you're gonna have someone that's gonna be looking out for you and they're really care about them because you know that for a fact. And just, I don't know, just later on in life, you're really just gonna look back at what you're doing and then you're gonna wanna change. So there you go, I'm done. Do you think free will can be an illusion? No, I don't think free will can be an illusion. Why? The reason why I'm saying this is because I have free will to let you interview me. Okay. I could have easily told you no. The way I'm talking to you right now, I have the free will to talk to you like this. You could be older than me and I'd be still talking to you in this tone. But for you to be talking, things have to be going on inside of your body before you say what you want to say. But what if I'm not really thinking about what I'm saying, I'm just saying as I go. But your just brain think thinks... about that, just think about that. What if everything that we say in our heads before we answer a question, do you really think you're really going to say those words? Those but, exact words? That's why people have problems talking to other people half the time. It comes down to serious stuff. But, Just take it in. But for words to come out, air has to move through your vocal cords, which moves them in a certain way. Okay, that's for the sound to come out. The whole word business, what you're really going to see. Exactly. It's this whole predetermined thing that you're seeing in your head, saying how I need to think of what I need to say first before I could do this, 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 this. Okay. Am I wrong or am I right? You're wrong. How am I wrong? <laughs> I'm joking, I'm joking. <laughs> All right.